Here's a better look at the eccentric. About right there it should measure a quarter of an inch, but it only measures about um, uh, 3 sixteenths. And I have just enough room on this side to move that to move the eccentric over on the new piece of course. There's a nice piece of uh, one inch diameter bronze 932. In the ideal world I would have had a piece of 7 8 inch bronze stock and I would have turned it down to three quarters and that would have given me a nice shiny finish on the circumference. But I don't have it so I'm going to use this three quarter piece or uh, one inch piece. I'll turn it down um, the uh, width of the eccentric uh, to, to three quarters. I will center drill it, drill it, and ream it for the main shaft. Then I will take it out of the three jaw, stick it in the four jaw, offset it correctly this time, and uh, return the eccentric. I'm going to have a uh, part zero of this series, which, if you're looking at the series, you already know because you've seen it, that um, details or uh, verbally list my screw up on the eccentric so you won't make it. That is, if you're you won't make it because I just know that you're watching every last second of this incredibly long uh, series of building this simple little engine. I'm going to face this at about 120 SFM. Alright, the eccentric needs to be a total of uh, 0.3233 inches thick or wide and uh, this grooving tool is, which I'm just going to use as an undercut, relief cut, is uh, 0.083 thousandths. So, 
I need to move towards the chuck a total of 0 0.4063. One hundred, two hundred, three hundred, four hundred, sixty, three. Now that thickness includes the, uh, the, the step for the eccentric. I'm trying to hit it right on the money. carriage right there. And I'll um, undercut it down to uh, something less than 0 0.750 from an inch to uh, 0 0.750. That's a quarter of an inch. I think this tool will do it. I'll check it before I actually do it. If it won't, then I'll have to redo all this. Alright, I'm gonna build me or cut me a turn me a, a relief cut, get out of jail free cut as I like to say. And since I'm gonna also part it there eventually, uh, it doesn't make much difference how deep it is, so it needs to be at least a quarter of an inch deep, a little over maybe, uh, since the piece is gonna be a quarter of an inch turn it down. So I'm just going to make it 300 thousandths. And I'm going to turn it at 130 SFM um, but feed it dead slow at uh, 0.0068 inches per revolution. got a towel under there to catch all the bronze. You might also notice I changed cutters because the, uh, the insert base cutter didn't quite have the reach. There's two 
out of the way. I'll take a file and chamfer that edge. No, I won't. It's too soon to do that because I'm going to take this down to three quarters of an inch. I'm going to turn this down to 0.750. Turn it at uh, 130 SFM, and then I'll drill and ream the uh, 0.1875 inch hole for the main chip. I won't make you watch on this. pieces down to point uh, 804 on the way to point 750. I'm gonna, I've been taking 50 thousandths inch cuts. I'm going to take 30 thousandths and, and then sneak on, sneak up to, sneak down to 750. Could be 750. I could look at one inch, I think. Yeah. Okay, we're at um, 764 and a half or so. So I'm going to take uh, 5 thousandths and see where we are. Take, 
eight thousands. So there's one, three, five, seven. I'm gonna hold it good at seven. You know, I'm going to leave it right there. There's, like I said, this diameter isn't critical. I don't want to go on. It's the only critical issue would be don't go under. So I'm not under it. That's where I'm leaving it. I'm going to center drill it. Drill it. Point uh, one eight two, which is number fourteen, and then ream it three sixteenths, which is point eighteen seventy five. I'm going to do all this at. Uh, about uh, 61 SFM. Depth of cut isn't uh, critical, as long as it's deep enough. So I'm going to go my measuring device. I'm going to go three quarters of an inch. Cruises the state sales in Detroit for me. What better place to get good American tools in Detroit? Gotta blow that out. Take this work piece out, clean up a little bit, mount the forward jaw, offset it the required amount, and return the eccentric, which is going to be about uh, 73 thousandths inch 
inches wide. I've got the workpiece centered in the fore jaw. Pretty good. Well then, I can't tell from this angle. Maybe half thousands or three quarters of a thousand. That's going to work. It'll work. So now I need to offset it a quarter of an inch, either axis or either axis on the fore jaw will work fine. I've got the workpiece centered in the fore jaw. Now I want to offset it an eighth of an inch and then choose these jaws to use for the offset. Doesn't make any difference which way I go, as long as it's an eighth of an inch. Hundred. Uh, kind of tight because of the other two jaws. Ah. We've got the workpiece in the fore jaw offset an eighth of an inch, which ought to give me a quarter inch total offset. I'm ready to cut. I'm going to use my um, cutoff tool. Last time I used a insert tool. I'm going to try this cutoff tool this time. And I will go till it's a circle. I will go till uh, we're cutting a complete circle and then stop at that moment and uh, measure it. And if it's uh, half an inch in diameter, we're good. If it's not, uh, I'll cut some more. left to cut about well, maybe a quarter of the circumference maybe less not much
polish them. It said 509, but it's 511. So we're going to, not we, me, I'm going to Try to take several more thousands off that maybe. Be back. Let's try a fit. Couldn't get too much better than that. Me happy. Now it's uh, time to cut the workpiece off to length. By the way, I mic that at 492. And this hole was 493 minus plug gauge. So that's my fits with it. Ready to part the eccentric off the uh, stock, and it 
I'll part it off such that it's the uh, same uh, width as the previous eccentric and keep adjustments to a, to a minimum on the, uh, on the engine. And I'm going to part uh, dead slow basically. Get my paper towel down there. job facing too. Didn't Here she is. I'll take the uh, burr off and be ready to rock and roll. I've got to, got to put a uh, 440 set screw in it.